customer hands me this screwdriver and says snap on quality isn't what it used to be what kind of ch up is this is this a harbor freight truck so i took it looked at it and said well what were you doing with it were you turning a number three phillips so then he says yes exactly i look at him like i don't believe him so i ask him one more time what were you doing with this are you sure you weren't using this as a pry bar now before we go any further i wasn't pressing him because i wasn't going to warranty the screwdriver i was genuinely curious i have never seen a phillips screwdriver bent like that usually it's the flat tips that take a beating how the hell did you bend a number three so he finally fessed up and he said he was using this to pry on a ball joint on a BMW. That sounds more realistic, doesn't it? 99 out of 100 times, I will gladly take your broken tools and hand you a brand new one. So don't worry guys, I handed him a new screwdriver and as we were swapping tools, of course I had to show him something new. I showed him this 3 8 heavy duty pin punch. It's 16 inches long, made of a hardened steel. You have a nylon handle with that great flared end cap which is gonna protect you from off-center strikes. But since I know you guys love to use those flat tip screwdrivers as pry bars, let me suggest to you the 10 inch straight blade striking pry bar. The shank and the tip are designed to fit in those tight spaces. And just like the pin punch, these two have the exact same handle. So remember guys, I'm always on the truck ready for you when shit like this happens, but it is kind of nice to have the right tool for the right job, right?